Basic flat iron how to start with dry hair, apply volumizing mousse before your hair dries if you want straight but still voluminous hair with lots of body. If you didn't already apply a heat protecting product before your hair dried, do so before you start with the flat iron. Divide your hair into at least 4 sections 2 on top and 2 on bottom. Work from bottom to top, using 1 inch sections. Clamp the flat iron as close to the roots as possible and pull it down the length of the hair slowly and steadily. Work your way around the bottom of the head and then release one top section to straighten. Follow with the last top section. Get additional volume at the roots, start close to the roots and straighten the hair while holding it up and away from the head, or pull hair toward the opposite side as you run the flat iron through. The longer your hair is, the wider your flat iron can be. 1. Creating flips to create a flip under, out, or away from the face with a flat iron, simply flick your wrist in the direction you'd like the hair to go as you near the end of each 1 inch section. Be sure to spray hairspray on that hair so that it will maintain the style rather than falling as the hair cools. Unless you have very long or very short hair, a 1 inch flat iron will be the easiest to use for creating flips and curls. 2. Curling with a flat iron. If you can only purchase one hair styling product, a flat iron is a wise choice. In addition to straightening and smoothing, it can also curl your hair. Start with the flat iron on a 1 inch section of hair that you'd like to curl. You can start close to the roots or further down the shaft of the hair, depending on the look you're going for. Wrap the hair around the iron once and then slowly pull the iron down and through the ends of the hair. Subscribe us to know more hair growth treatments and tips.